Can man decree a thing and have it come to pass? Most decidedly he can. Man has always decreed that which has appeared in his world and is today decreeing that which is appearing in his world and shall continue to do so as long as man is conscious of being man. Not one thing has ever appeared in man's world but what man decreed that it should. This you may deny, but try as you will, you cannot disprove it. For this decreeing is based upon a changeless principle. You do not command things to appear by your words or loud affirmations. Such vain repetition is more often than not confirmation of the opposite. Decreeing is ever done in consciousness. That is, every man is conscious of being that which he has decreed himself to be. The dumb man, without using words, is conscious of being dumb. Therefore, he is decreeing himself to be dumb. Quote, you shall decree a thing and it shall come to pass. This is his decreeing, rising in consciousness to the naturalness of being the thing desired. If I be lifted up in consciousness to the naturalness of the thing desired, I will draw the manifestation of that desire unto me. If you are dissatisfied with your present expression in life, the only way to change it is to take your attention away from that which seems so real to you and rise in consciousness to that which you desire to be. You cannot serve two masters. Therefore, to take your attention from one state of consciousness and place it upon another is to die to one and live to the other.